Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Garrett here, back at you again with Pokemon Randomized Ruby. In the last episode we had gotten to Sleepport City. No, this is Duford. Yep, this is Duford. Alright, and now what we are going to do is let me check our team real quick over a quick team recap because we haven't done any grinding or anything like that. So we got Swine Up, Serpa the Sun Swine Kerpa. Kerp of the swine up, ice type rock or ground. What am I talking about? Oblivious and tackle and odor sluice. Shitty in that department. But then we got our boy, our girl. I'm talking about boy. I got we got a girl, Selena. Sing charm pound and poison sting. Rocking that cute charm, quiet nature. Then I got my man Polybo. Water absorb, water gun, hypnosis and bubble. And then finally we got our latest encounter, bipolar. Then the the Nincata, Scratch Harden, and Leech Life. Compound Eyes, Timid Nature. Kind of sucks that it's timid. Could have been jolly, but whatever. Uh, we can... I think we can manage. Um, where's my back button? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I'm stupid. Uh, playing on my PS4 controller right now, so... So that's Route 107. Let's see here. I do like the fish. I hear you, and I like what you're saying. I'll give you one of my fishing rods. Got the old rod. All right, so this actually means we can actually go back and we can get a lot of it encounters that we could not get encounters before. Meaning that even though we cannot surf in uh, this spot, get the fuck away from me. I'm trying to get shut up. Meaning even though we cannot surf in this spot, we can actually fish. Get an encounter right here. So our encounter for Route 107 is Dun. a Venonat. Interesting. Okay, a Venonat. Okay, Venonat. I've never really used a Venonat in a playthrough before. So we can just go for these tackles. Get that shell nice and taken care of. You can you can confuse me and I'll hit myself in confusion. And I'll miss my tackles because that's just what I want. Alright, fuck you. Take this Pokeball. Take this Pokeball, you purple bitch. Alright, I already know what I'm gonna name my boy here. He is so purple and so fluffy. Uh Venonat, the insect. Pokemon. Venonat is said to have evolved with a coat of thin, stiff hair that covers its entire body for protection. It possesses large eyes that never fail to spot even minuscule prey. So we got our girl, or boy, Venonat here. Yeah, it's boy. Uh, I'm going to name you exactly what I thought about naming you just now. You, my friend, are going to be OG Perp. OG Perp. OG Perp. He's OG purple as fuck. Alright, so we just caught Venonat. Let's go heal. Alright, so let's see here. Let's check out our new Pokemon. Oh, it's holding an item. I'll take that from you. TM31. I cannot wait to see what that is. Compound eyes. Serious nature. It's neutral. Bug poison. Raises accuracy. Mm, decent defenses. Decent attack stats, that's fine. Tackle, disable, foresight, and supersonic. So, not bad. Not bad at all. At all. Uh, we'll keep we'll keep Serpa in front right now. Just until we get it up to level 10, then we might switch out into our Nincata. We are not going to fuck with this fucker's gym just yet. Oh, this reminds me. Hold on. Uh, now that we have a Nincata who is notorious for learning cut gonna go ahead and teach it cut we go and it's the only Pokemon on our team that can learn cut thankfully uh, this is Duford Hall Info everyone's information exchange setting up on small comics yeah okay don't know something something comic these guys are all apparently obsessed with comics is small comics even more? What the fuck? I don't know what you guys are talking about, honestly. I mean, uh, it was awesome. It was a real thing. Oh yeah. Oh no 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 no. That alleged small comics you claim to have seen—it's not. The authentic article is much. How should I say it? 
sharper, yet more mellifluous. Oh, no matter. Okay, whatever. A bunch of nerds talking up in the here. Fucking nerds, I don't have time to deal with you guys. So this is Route 106. Do we have an encounter for here yet? We don't, so we can get an encounter for Route 106. Uh, let's go ahead and do it. Let's just go ahead and do it. Okay, here we go. Getting an encounter for Route 106. We have not even a nibble. Do we want to fight this guy first? Might as well. Might as well. That's what I was considering doing before I started fishing, and then apparently the Pokemon gods just wanted that to be the case. They wanted that to happen first. So Ledian's going to come out. Serper is probably not going to be able to fight this thing. And I don't know who is. I gotta, I've got to do some grinding on my new mons. I cannot fight anything. Uh, we'll try and stay in. And we'll try and just fight. See what this thing has to go for. Tackle's not going to be doing much damage, and my own tackle's not going to be doing much damage. So, if worse comes to worse, I can hit myself in confusion. I can hit myself. Alright, you know what? You need to get out of here. I'm going to go out into Selena. Whoa! Why don't you just go to fucking sleep? Yeah, get fucking cute charmed. Get immobilized. Selena, did you use up all your sing, like, hitting points back at that gym? Thank you. Jesus. You're the one that needs compound eyes. Alright. Go for these pounds. Wow. Alright, whatever. Come on. You can do it. We can just let it be immobilized by love. One more. And nice. Dodge all those supersonics. Dodge all those supersonics, Selena. If you can't hit your moves, you might as well fucking dodge those moves. I lost because I'm trying to not go to the washroom. Why are you trying not to go to the washroom, my friend? Why? Alright, so here we can try to get that encounter. Route 106. Our encounter is... Let's see. Here we go. It's a Feebass. Okay. Feebass. It's kind of going to be a pain in the ass because I actually have to do the contests just to get uh, Feebass up to a, like a good level. Or to get it to evolve into Milotic, I need it to be a, uh, in a, con a, like a contest winner, have like high beauty or something like that. Um, well, fuck you too. Uh, I guess I might as well tackle it. It really can't do anything to me. One more tackle ought to do it. And then we can just throw a Pokeball at it. Um, that's fine, I suppose. It's a lot easier to catch Feebass here than it was in uh, the original Pokemon Ruby. So, Kacha, 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 Kacha. And honestly, because I'm probably never gonna get... Oh, wait a second. Feebass's fins are ragged and tattered from the start of its life. Because of its shoddy appearance, this Pokemon is largely ignored. It is capable of living in both the sea and in rivers. So, just because it's a Feebass, and Feebasses are supposed to look ugly, I'm just going to name you... Rat... I might be so this wrong. Chet. You are Ratchet. Ratchet. Is that how you spell Ratchet? I don't want to take the chance of being wrong in that. Uh, we'll just call you... Um, I'm going to call you Duff. The designated ugly fat friend. You are the Duff. Duff the Feebass. Let's see what else is over here. Ah, fuck. I walked right into that one. So we got Feebass. Who cannot touch me. Nice, nice, nice. You know, in place of Magikarps, what do they do? They give me... Feebass. Honestly, I'd probably rather have a Magikarp than a Feebass. It would have been a lot easier to level up and evolve. Sweet! We learned Powder Snow. Uh, Zuril is going to come out. This is the perfect time to start leveling up our Ninkata. Uh, what am I doing? Um, Where's my shift? Oh, there it is. All right, so, cut. Start cutting this bitch alive. Bubble. Whoa! Bubble to doing too much, too much damage. All right, I obviously feel like I can't do anything to this thing, so I'm going to go out into OG Perp. And we can just start tackling. I don't care if you're going to charm me, Doug. Do Oh, we get crits. That's what OG Perp is out here for. We're getting crits. I didn't even see what that was. I'm going to stay in. On the snow rut? You bet your ass I'll stay in. Whoa! Let's get that fucking move out of here. Now we're going to go for a supersonic. Wow, OG Perp. Killing it right now. Going to Polybo. Because we don't want to deal with any of this. We can go for, oh, come on. 
first turn double team, you're gonna miss a wor a fucking water gun. Come on, Polybo. Polybo. Nice. All right, so taking care of that. And I think there's an item over here. I thought there was. Might be on this rock. Yes, Stardust. Got a Stardust. All right. Um, I don't think there's a Mart on this island. Is there? I don't think so. What's in this? What's in? The, what's in here? There better be a Mart of some kind in here. There's a lot to be said for living on a small island like this in harmony with Pokemon and the family. I came from the large port of Slateport City when I married my husband here. Life goes by slowly on this little island, but being surrounded by the beautiful sea, that's happiness too. But, you know, that's a good philosophy. I really like that. That's very, very positive. That's very, very positive. So, we got all of our encounters for Doofer Town. Because there's not an actual Pokemon. Wait. Did I get an encounter for Doofer Town? I don't think so. Wait a second. So... I know I can get an encounter in, Petal in most of the towns that have water, because that's the only way I can really catch Pokemon. So hold on a second. Doofer Town. And this water right here, that's, this this water is still technically Doofer Town, because this is Route 107, and this is Doofer Town. So wow, I almost totally skipped that. So we have an encounter for Doofer Town. This will be our first town encounter. Thank God we got this old rod. Ugh, I only have three Pokeballs, though. So I really gotta be careful. Because I do not want to have to go all the way back to the motherfucking Pokemart at uh, Petalburg. So not even a nibble. We're gonna keep trying until we get something. Come on. Come on. Shit. Come the fuck on. Okay. Uh, let me try going around. So, Alright, this is still due for town. Let's try right here. There we go. Alright, so our first encounter for Duford Town is... Oh, yeah! <laughs> Joked on something right there. A motherfucking Cinda... Wait, Cinda... I don't know how to spell Cinda Quill. Right there on the screen. Cinda Quill. Fuck yes. Alright, I'm not fucking this up. We are catching this bitch. All right, I'm gonna go for powdered snow because it should be neutral. Okay, sweet, 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 sweet. Uh, one. Oh, I'm scared to eat. Ah, no! Ah! I clicked run. Ah! Ah! We didn't catch a Cyndaquil. Oh my god, we didn't catch a Cyndaquil. Oh, we catch a Feebas, but we didn't catch a Cyndaquil. Oh, oh. oh my god, we caught a Feebas, but we didn't catch a Cyndaquil. I can't believe this just happened. Oh, I can't believe that just happened. Oh, my heart. Oh, we didn't catch a Cyndaquil, but we caught a Feebas. But we caught a Feebas, though. But we caught a Feebas, though. That's just peachy. That's that's peachy. We caught a Feebas. We didn't catch motherfucking Cyndaquil. Probably would have been the best fucking Pokemon for us to catch. Um, wait, what is this? This is the Granite Cave. That's right. Granite Cave. At least we can try to get a fucking encounter here. I gotta be careful with that speed up and my D-pad. <sighs> what's, what's my dude here? It's awfully dark head. That guy came earlier. I think it was he. He knew how to use flash, so he ought to be all right. But well, for us hikers, helping out those that we meet is our motto. So here we go. I'll pass this on to you. HMO five, which is flash. All right. Honestly, like I don't give a fuck about fucking flash. I don't even think any of my Pokemon can learn it. Honestly, let me check. Uh, flash. Who can learn this? Selena can actually learn this. I don't want to teach it to Selena. Uh, let's see here. Charm. I'm never really using Charm, honestly. So I think I'm going to get rid of Charm for Flash. Just because I really don't want to have to deal with all that fucking shit. I never use Flash on a Mon, but 
I think I'm just gonna make the exception this time. I just don't want to deal with it. So let's try and get our first encounter in Granite Cave. It is. <sighs> I don't want to play anymore. I just don't. I just fucking don't, you guys. I miss out on a Cyndaquil, but my next encounter is a fucking Rattata. A motherfucking shit sucking Rattata. Fuck you, Rattata. Get fucking frozen, bitch. So just not in the mood for these bitches, dude. That's right, you stay in that fucking ball. So we caught a Rattata. Rattata is cautious in the extreme. Even while it is asleep, it constantly listens by moving its ears around. It is not picky about where it lives. It will make its nest anywhere. Give a nickname to the Rattata. Have no choice. Uh, what was the nickname I had? I had a Rattata at one point, and I had a nickname for it, like a special nickname. I just can't remember what it was called. Um, shit. I guess... Uh, Name it, uh, um, I'm gonna name you Buck. I'm gonna name you Buck. Buck, because you got buck teeth. I know it's really, really nice and original. Fuck it, I don't care. Probably could have fit teeth on there, but just whatever. Alright, um, who do I want in front right now? Like I said, I need bipolar to start getting some levels, so. We will start with that. Got an escape rope. Honestly, I'd rather go through the trouble of raising a Feebas before I ever go through the trouble of raising a fucking Rattata. Um. Oh, fuck me. I just... I just... Don't, why, why, is it, why is it doing this to me? Why is it doing this to me? Alright, what's about to happen here is I might have to end up taking on Brawly. I might end up having to take on Brawly. But the problem with that is that my Pokemon are nowhere near high enough level for us to even attempt to do so. So, uh, we didn't really make much progress in this episode, honestly. Um, hmm, do I want to try? Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go into the gym. And I'm going to gauge exactly what I'm going to be dealing with while in this bitch. Um, okay, so we're going to gauge these trainers' mons and see how well we can do up against these. Because they're all randomized, so they're not all fighting types. Um, Spoink is going to come out at level 14, so... And I think his ace is 18, so... Kind of got a problem. And I definitely don't even want to take the chance of me getting bodied right now. So we're going to go on Selena, even though it has just Splash. Um, I hope it doesn't just have Splash, because then I could have just stayed in. Um, I'm very, very confident it has something other than Splash, and I do, yes, yeah, Psy Wave. We're just going to keep going for pounds, and we're about to kill it. Uh, see, like shit like that, i got to be careful with shit like that. Psy Wave is just one of those mo moves I do not want to fuck with. So... I think what's going to happen, you guys, is we're going to end the episode here, and we're going to train up our mons, and we're just going to we're going to grind, we're going to grind for a little bit, and then we're just going to see exactly what's what's going to happen. We're going to see what's going to happen. Uh, let me see real quick. I think um, move some Pokemon around. Ugh, ugh! I did not want to come back and see all my dead failures. I don't know why you're here. I mean, he's holding an item. Um, actually, move you, pick you up. I'm just going to say, sorry, Phoebus. If I want to train you at any point later when I get up higher levels, then I probably will. Uh, let's get this TM off of here. I don't know what it is, but we will, we will check. And then it is Gust. The TM for Gust. OG Perp can learn Gust? Fuck yeah. Gust is a shitty move anyway, so I have no problem just going ahead and teaching it. Get rid of Foresight for that shit, because it's very situational. We learned Gust. Nice. Okay, so now I think is when I will end the episode off. Thank you guys for watching this episode, and I hope you have a great night.